what is up youtube knife community back again today we're gonna go over some mods real quick uh first up if you want to hit me up this is how you get in touch with me uh through instagram or email is the two easiest ways and there it is um first up we're gonna take a look at uh some knives from my buddy robert uh and not too long ago i did this uh yo jumbo for him right here uh came out very nice uh so here's a good look at your knife again robert i just did some tweaking on it for him but uh here it is getting ready to come back to you buddy same as it was but uh with the changes that we made there's that and uh here's your 20 cv yo jimbo if i can get it to focus there you are reshape the blade here uh reshape the handles uh yeah I took these two humps out and uh contoured this a little more made it just a little straighter there chamfered the corners of the scales there made these like usually these are concave a little bit i make them flat feel so much better in the hand uh fix the spine you know like that uh added the finger tool there so yeah for me this makes this knife so much better it looks cooler closed up i think but yep there it is i think it came out gorgeous but there's that one uh next up this one here all i did was flushed it out for him and uh uh put a new edge on it if i, can, I can't get this damn thing to focus today but there you go it's got a new edge on it there you are uh for some reason this one came this right here was like uh curved like it had a pretty pronounced curve in it so i took that out for him and put him a new edge on it and the action is so much better than it was flushed it out uh so much better We'll put this one right here. Uh, next up is another Yo Jumbo, and this is for uh, for a guy that has emailed me. Uh, so yeah, this is for him. I think it's got a little oil on the blade there, but I'll get that off. But uh, yeah, there it is. Reshape the handle as always. Bronze the hardware. Uh, acid wash the the blade and the liners. Uh, Heat anodized the back spacer or the barrel spacers there. Uh, came out smoking hot. Reshaped the spine of the blade. Added the tool. There it is. Came out nice. Good action. Good smooth action. Yep. So there's another Yo Jumbo. Uh, next up, here's a CJRB Crag. This is going to Canada to a guy that reached out through email. I don't know if he watches my YouTube channels, but. Uh, here it is for you, buddy, if you're watching. Uh, purple Crag. Of course, uh, this is a total transformation on this knife. Uh, delete the flipper tab. Extend the tool. Um, add the spidey hole. Reshape the blade to a sheep's foot instead of a cleaver. Dye the scales. Acid wash blade. Acid wash liners. Bronze hardware. Smooth action very nice knife now i think oops stabbed the table there's that one next up is a black spotty rat and this this one is uh getting ready to go overseas uh this is for a, a military guy and he's getting ready to be deployed i don't know exactly when but he says he's taking this knife with him so we'll see how they hold up uh so there's that uh everything blacked out except for uh the blade and the liners are acid washed left the clip black on this one super nice knife smooth action the whole nine next up is a purple spidey rat and this is going to nate prince he's on instagram as print something i can't remember exactly he's got some numbers after his name this one's going to him uh bead blasted the screws and then polished them and bronzed them and uh acid wash the blade the liners the clip and then bronze the clip after the acid wash came out smoking hot 
think i think so anyway added a spidey hole on the chool uh yeah that's it right there super nice knife yep next up uh i guess i'm calling this the ultimate spidey rat and uh i actually did this in anticipation that somebody might buy it and so far uh the guy that i thought was going to buy it has not so uh unless this gets sold pretty soon it is for sale i'm gonna turn this one light off maybe i can get a better shot of it so uh this is fly titanium titanium scales with the uh with the uh lightning strike anno on it there's the blade a good shot of the blade and the edge acid wash liners and scales this is a modified mxg clip as you can see Let's see if we can see this better it's in my stories on instagram if uh the natural light is so much better for showing the shit off but uh the uh clip and the scales kind of match the 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 fade you know from blue to purple like that it's blue back here and then it goes up to purple around the corner of the scales here on both sides as you can see there it's purple up front but yeah it came out smoking hot so this one is for sale but uh it's pretty expensive and parts alone i've got like well over a hundred bucks in the scales and the clip and the knife but um if anyone's interested in that hit me up uh it's definitely over two hundred dollars uh so yeah just a heads up so you're not wasting your time or my time but it is for sale but it's going to be expensive but anyways, that's all I've got to show off today. Um, again, this is how you get in touch with me. If you want any of these mods or any other mods, just hit me up. There's a lot of stuff coming up that uh, that are unique knives that I haven't done yet. Uh, it's going to be uh, a lot of fun and definitely interesting. So uh, keep watching. Um, pretty soon there's going to be a giveaway, guys. I'm still playing in it. I got one going on over on Instagram. Uh, if you don't follow me on Instagram go do that because uh i'm giving away a spider code native five and uh civivi odium a couple flashlights and a couple hanks so uh if you've got instagram and you're not following me you should go do that and sign up to win that giveaway anyways that's all i've got thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next one